So, hey everybody, hello, how are you? <laughs> They've uh, let me out to do something today and I am basically um, just taking a run out in the 140 uh, X series from uh, the JCB or well, we've actually borrowed it from Denison's. Um, I don't get much of a chance to drive diggers um, and the footage will show you that. I love diggers, I love them, but I'm not a digger man. But um, we came along to my good friend, Farmer Philip, and uh, I must apologise because uh, the last time we put up a video with Philip and the Stroudman wagon, um, we, we called him Farmer Phil. We didn't mean any offence to Farmer Phil or anything like that. He's just been known to me as Philly Boy Farmer Phil my whole life. We've been friends my whole life. He was doing a bit of a, a job on this farm here and he had a wee bit of soil to, to, to take back. Um, so Gary's on the Valtra just with their NC dump trailer and uh, Philip's dad, Dez. Big Dez! Big Dez! Big Dez is on the 6 8. So um, I just said that I would love a bit of a day on the, the 140 just to see how I got on. So as I say, look, it's many, many years since I've been doing really any proper digger driving. But uh, oh man, I feel so good. intention here at Grassman was it's not to uh, try and go and be digger men. We, um, we fully intend to run this digger uh, as a few demos to a couple of agricultural sort of digger men if that makes any sense. Uh, agriculture type digger work because farms are synonymous with uh, diggers through you know that's how I did a wee bit of digger work years and years ago when I worked to uh, Davy Porter, um, Porter Contracts way back when I was at university and I started doing a bit of digger work for them and just a way back it was a Samson 130 and then a JS believe it or not a JS 130 came and I always enjoyed my time um, messing about in diggers. Uh, you know we put up a picture the other day that we had this digger on straight away there's a lot of comments both negative and positive and we're the sort of guys that we believe in trying to deliver the best message for every machine that we can. But um, 
a lot of guys are like, you should have an Hitachi or whatever. And it's funny because it was the Hitachi digger that came through in the comments, comment after comment, you should have an Hitachi. But I want to make this clear without offending anyone, okay? Denison's have taken on the JCB construction side, right? And Denison's have based... Well, they haven't told me this, but from what I can see, Denison's run um, one of the most successful Volvo lorry franchises, probably, um, in the UK, if not further afield. And they are renowned for their backup and their service. And at heart, I'm a Volvo man. There's no question about that. So, um, I was very excited um, when Denison Group took on the JCB um, franchise, to tell you the honest truth. Um, I thought this is going to be big, big inroads for JCB because what guys really want is back up service and commitment. So to the guys with the, to the guys putting out there, you should get yourself an Atachi. Absolutely nothing against an Atachi. Um, you know, if any of the dealers running them want to get one up, we say, yeah, we, we, we make sure a couple of people get to look at it. But you can't take away from the fact that this is Denison group. This is their group. And they always put on a big show at Balmoral. And that's why we, we thought, well, whenever the opportunity was there, the lockdown show, we would ask if we could maybe try something, I guess, because this digger will be going straight out to um, building sites once we're finished in a week or 10 days, once it goes by, it'll be going straight out to sites to do a few. What can I tell you about this digger? To be honest, not a lot. Generator Jeff is going to come out. Um, we have organised, hopefully, to get it alongside a guy running a JS131, I think, Pro. So we have organised to get it uh, out there. He's, he's uh, working at a tank, digging out a tank on a farm there in the background. Um, so he's not digging for a couple of days. So the plan is, we're going to get it out there to him and uh, have a wee look at it beside the new X140. And I think that would be an absolutely fantastic guy to run a demo um, for a couple of days on the digger and see how they get on. What can I tell you about the digger? Well, it's the first JCB product I think that I have, have driven that, that, that boasts JCB's own engine four-cylinder engine, something like 106 horsepower. Um, as far as pumps and that are concerned, I'm sorry guys, I can't answer you that at this stage, but what I can tell you is, and a few mates of mine have bought new diggers, we've had Cabelcos, Hitachis, different diggers lately we've, we've been on, and this is up there, this is up there with the smoothest of them all. And so that's something I must commend JCB for. Now we're sitting here with seven hours on the clock, so there's a lot of work for this baby to do yet before it's even, as they would say, broken in. Sorry, I'm not a digger, man. I often wondered if I could, uh, if I'd have stayed on the digger, would I ever have managed or mastered it, you know? And then I thought to myself, oh my. Look what happened the way back Robert McConaughey turned out and he spent all his time on a digger. <laughs> you know I love you really, Duracell. <laughs> love to wind you too, right enough. <laughs> uh, but it's great, the, the agricultural side of digger work is, a, is, is big business. Um, you know, there's a lot of really good digger men I've watched out there and they could they could thread the eye of a needle with a digger and they spend their whole life in farms, working in farms. It's a, it's a large part of it and uh, they're not all for building sites and construction sites, as you know, and that's what we were sort of trying to, to get at. Another thing too, when I have the camera on me and I'm not in donkey cam, I'm actually doing something I want to thank everybody, um, every one of our fans throughout the world who has really stood by us and supported us throughout the COVID-19 
you have no idea what it means to us as a company. At the start of coronavirus, we honestly thought times were going to be different. And we, we anticipated a lot of people and layoffs. And we've worked very hard and that's probably, this is one of the seeds of that work. We work very hard in trying to help local businesses get out there and uh, you know showcase their products and I suppose Denison's as a group were one of those companies um, that we asked to be a part of that lockdown series and uh, you know that was you know <laughs> they asked us at the time what could we do um, as a thank you basically and he said give us a digger a lot of these and that's that's really how that came about and uh, oh, I'm loving it I don't think I could explain how happy I am today see the way I'm just rabbiting on chatting away wanting to talk about anything and everything that means I'm happy I'm happy today <laughs> Gary's got a wee GoPro at the front of the trailer and if you see me sticking my tongue out <laughs> like this here I'm biting it you'll know I'm I'm concentrating and not trying not to have it. <laughs>